Hello, NJRoot22.com viewers. Today, as you can see from our video there, we're going to go look at a road that we haven't really looked at yet. It's called County Road 523. It goes uh, in weird ways, uh, north and east and west. But we're going to cover this one from <clears throat> south of Route 22 from White House all the way to Flemington. And it's an interesting road because there are basically three ways to get to Route I mean, I'm sorry, to get to uh, Flemington from from Route 22. And that's Route 31 from the Clinton area, Route 202 from the bridge uh, water area, and then Route 523 from the White House area. And there I just sped it up. And it's uh, going fast here through the from White House and Route 22 to the downtown, quote unquote, of what, what's this town called? Uh, yeah, White House. You got you got some restaurants. You got a train station where 93 people a day use that train station. It's a massive train station. 93 people use it. There's a bar there. I guess where a bunch of middle-aged people hook up. You got a post office. You got uh, some businesses that come and go some hair salons the, you know the volunteer fire department and then you know well, here here's the post office right here and then we're going to speed it up now towards the middle of the section and i put a little uh, special effects here this is like uh what do you call it cartoonish so we'll, we'll speed through here this is a residential area one thing about this road, and you have to be very aware of this if, if you're not in the know, that between like, I don't know, 2 and maybe uh, no, 2.30 and 4 p.m., the school buses just ruin this road. And you're going to see this here. There's school buses left and right, but they stop, and then the, the entire road has to stop, which is great. Uh, I don't want any kids, but this is Drayhook. And that's a, a major intersection. <laughs> As you can see, the um, school buses um, really mess things up here. And this, this made my video so much less enjoyable. But it's a nice road. It's a nice uh, big kind of road fast most times um, but it gets annoying if you travel through these between 2 and 4 p.m. it's just not a good time to um, go th travel anywhere in Jersey the school buses ruin everything but luckily they turn off eventually I have a problem with my microphone. I had a good mic issue before, and now it's uh, repeating through my um, speakers, which I, I don't understand why. But anyway, so we, as we get further south towards Flemington, it speeds up a little because, you know, I think there's a couple more, one or more stops, and then. Um, the, the bus turns off and it, it, it just makes life so much easier. It really sucks to have to stop behind these buses. I mean, life was a little bit different when I was a kid and we got off on the bus and we waited till the cars went, went away. There was no stop sign arms and telling us what to do. And I think it's great, um, I guess, in the safety perspective, to keep the kids safe. But I'd rather teach the children to learn how to, to understand when it's safe to cross, rather than, hey, here's a sign and everybody's expected to behave. Um, I really think um, 
it would be better to teach the kids to, you know, to look both ways. And when they're certain it's safe to cross, just cross. But that's not how it works these days. These kids will expect someone to, to, to help them every step of the way. And that's, that's not so great. Um, they, should, they should learn self-sufficiency, which is very important. Anyway, we're almost, uh, we have a few more minutes here. That bus turned away and we were able to f fly at like 60, 60 and a 50 zone. Big deal. Um, but it, it was it was more normal. There's a natural speed for every road. And and the natural speed where you feel like you, you can drive safely and, and avoid most accidents is usually 10, at least 10 miles an hour over the limit that they post which makes it easy for them to uh, pull you over for, for violating this decreed speed limit. I mean, I know when I get into a twisty road that I'm not going to drive 100 miles an hour. I'm going to drive, you know, according to the capabilities of my car. Anyway, we're getting to the end of this uh, Route 523. It doesn't hit Route 31 exactly. It turns by the Diamond uh, Nation uh, baseball stadium so this is where 523 ends and that's it 